Thank you for the follow. Hey, hey, hey. It's me, Melanie Wandersong. Boom. Lines are dead. What, what was the new dance we got last time? Oh, that's right. We dabs. <laughs> All right. So, have more bird puzzles. We did it. I assume we have to go somewhere. Oh, oh. oh gimme, give gimme. Give I forget they eat me like that. Oh, oh. Babies in my lap, hello babies. No, no. Marigold's being very nice and trying to sleep in my lap, but Aster wants to get up on on my keyboard, which is not legal. <gasps> Boyfriend, Mr. Monster. Wow, I can't believe it, you. This is gonna be really embarrassing if it's just another one that looks kind of like him. Do you live in this cave now? Can I come through? Oh. P point at me, point at you. No. Was it just another guy and he, now he won't talk to me because I'm racist? Think about this. God. If there's one thing you can say for chapter five, it's that it gave us plenty to talk about. <laughs> What's up, board? You gonna vouch for us? <laughs> Thank you very much for the sub. Be cool. Whoa, Aster, whoa. Chaos. Oh wait, one sec, I've also got Photoshop open. I gotta close that shit. Gonna ruin everything. Because I was busy removing my lines. What? Yeah. Do you have anything else open that I should close? Why, thank you very much. We walking together? Come on! What are these? What are these is? Oh! Thank you! Oh boy! Boog! Are they boog? It, it, it's because it's to match the game! I, too, am a flash-looking motherfucker. Oh. 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 Gonna happen. Eh. Try not to step on him. Well, just just walk behind them on the three-dimensional plane. Mm. 
Fine, if you're gonna fucking be like that. Hey, hey, hey. Ho. What is it? I see. These ones count as being on the same plane of existence as me. Mini boog. What is this? Hollow Knight? So many boog. Look, was I not justified? We needed it to save the world, and she was like, "Now clean my garden first. And then I and and <laughs> and then the game wanted me to to be all sad. That's also true. Did you get to the rest of Act Five? I got increasingly less patience as it went. Oh. Oh god. Oh. <laughs> and yeah. It was funny because I came back the next day being like, I'm not going to be all salty. I'm going to be really patient. We're just going to get through this and we're going to stay positive. And then it was like, here's some bullshit janky platforming in, in the giant witch map. And I was like, I choose violence. I can't get past there, right? Yeah. I go this way. I know we got to save the world, little bard. Whoop. Aha! I have so many problems with how the, the plotting of that whole section went. Like, the, the ghost girl, the ghost girl, she delivers her her ghost message and, and they only do bad things. They only cause worse things to happen. And then we solve the 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 you know we solve racism just completely w without her input and she never even like by then she's just kind of gone and it's like that's cool i'm glad what a weird story and all of her sisters are just like being dicks to her about being dead and they're like just don't haunt us and like what a we why did you do this <laughs> uh yeah that's true i need to use that more uh, yeah, Miriam is her, and so she's she's going back to be with her grandma for now, and so I'm all alone. It, it's my second darkest moment. Yeah, it's one thing if, like, she was able to learn a lesson from that or whatever, but the only takeaway from that is her daughter died to try to do something, and then she couldn't. But we can. Us outsiders who don't know shit about this whole situation can, obviously. Wait. Oh. I'm trying. Oh, oh, they're they're happy with me. friends now do manual labor for me boogs yeah so really what is the the takeaway supposed to be there <laughs> with Paula and that shit just it isn't that easy to to stop war you have to be the main character and suddenly have a weird new psychic ability Oh, can they? Oh, you be my lifted friend, my lifted friend. 
Well, that's why they're so mighty. Hmm. See, that would have been fine. There's so many ways you could have gone with that with that story, and they just didn't. Hmm, okay, I'm gonna figure out what, what the issue is here. I got you. Wait, oh. We just pass each other. It's fine. Hey, we, we have bug friends. They're helping us. Because we were very nice and did not step on them, except for all the times we accidentally stepped on them. No, we're bug bending. Uh, dang it. Look, were we ever not on those discussions? Look, we say the point, but what was the point other than war hurts people? Which is like, wow, really? <laughs> well, well, we we befriended some bugs. Oh, war, heh, hook. What is it good for? Absolutely nothing. Yeah, but see, collective action is, is fucking chismist. And that chapter was great. We're at the end game? Are we really? Huh. You could, but you don't need to do it longer and worse. What is it good for? Absolutely nothing. Sing it again, y'all. Yeah, we'll see about about what kind of speed we're finishing things at and stuff. No, this is chapter six now. I don't remember what this chapter was called. Now, what do I need to tell y'alls to do? Get 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 with the other ones and get even bigger. Get even bigger? Bigger? No. That was incorrect. Hmm. Oh, beats like my mountain. Oh, do I have to go over to that other one? Meow. Wait, did I come from here? I don't remember. Y'all, come here. More boog. More boog. More of them. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Aster! Oh no! Look what you did. You ruined my speed run. <laughs> it's an Aster disaster! No. See, see, now that I said no, you can't get up, he's like, Fuck. There's nothing I need more now than to get up. Oh my god, look at this boot pile. See, now they learned how to be on a, on a different 2D plane than me. It's bullshit. I, I, I feel like they suddenly multiplied greatly. No! Yo! Get out of my fucking way! Bye bye! Bye bye, bug! I'm chilly. 
Oh, now all four babies are on my lap. Ba woof. Ba woof. What's cooler than being cool? Ice cold! Hey, Seal, what's cooler than being cool? All right, all right, all right, all right. Don't see me doing so good. <gasps> Look at them. Kinda. Do, do you want rocked? Is this what you eat? <gasps> you like it? You like it? Heart. <laughs> We're friends. <gasps> Beautiful. Yeah, they're wrestling on. on <gasps> What's up, dude? You tired? You need more delicious rock? Yum, 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 yum. Nope. Oh no. You're a little janky, my friends. But that's okay, because you're cute. Here, take rock. Thank you very much for the sub! Look, Miriam never let me steer her broom with song. Thank you. And we got janky Miriam. Yum, yum, yum. Give you pet. Let's go! Dang it! I was hoping I could make the jump. <laughs> you go. Yum, 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 yum. Come here. This way. Hop. Thank you. Here, we'll get you more rocks. You okay? We got this guy getting more rocks. Come on. More rocks. Here you go. You smile. You smile. Okay, here, I want to make sure what I'm doing. Okay. Invisible wall. Nom nom nom. You look at your suffering constantly. Just eat all the rocks. Look, eat this one and this one and also this one. We have beat. Oh. I got another rocks for you. Here you go. And there's a treat. Make sure I don't go too far and end up falling off. Come with me, friend. Oh, babies, I'm sorry. This is way too awkward for my lap. You can't all just sleep here. I'm sorry. I love you. I do love you. Oh, God. Oh, 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 leg hurt. Oh, God. Okay. I love all of you, my children. Why is it only now that you all want to sleep in my lap all together? I know, this is a problem. What if people like lying with me more? It's unacceptable. I've made a horrible mistake. Oh. No, 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 baby. Baby, do not cling, do not cling to my cord. I'm sorry. <laughs> you guys want to be tubers? The tubesers? Okay. Uh, ha. ha. Nope.
I am patient. I am patient like saint. Maybe I can just go ahead and start get up up on you here. Dang it. Okay. No. Let's fucking go. <laughs> oh, my babies. Yum. 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 Alright, you good? Y'all all nice and full? Tummy full? Let's go! I need some more rocks for your tum tum. I need some more rocks for your tum tum. There. Yum. Home. Yum. Home. Home. Yum. Home. Yum. Home. Yum. Well, yeah, I don't want to go all the way till it's frowny. Uh. That didn't work out so well. friends. Hello. Welcome back. Sorry about that. Yes, you gotta be fat for the cold. Just like me. <laughs> it's very valid. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> Alright, I, I gotta go more up initially. They all, they all managed to somehow rearrange themselves still all on my lap. This is a disaster. I'm gonna save you this way. Okay, uh, this is gonna be awkward. What? <laughs> the power of collective action. Further up? Oh, or up to the left there? Come here. Come here. Look, babies, I, we can't do this. We can't do this. My legs. There is pain. Here, you go there and you go there. Be somewhere else. <laughs> I love you. Yeah, or eat. That's all. That also works. All right. Where's your next meal? Um, num. Um, num. Nope. Uh. No. <laughs> well, no, no. It's me, my sin. No. It's me, my sin. Oh, oh, wait. I guess. I guess. Gee, thanks for the help. 
Yum, yum, yum. Oh my god, two of them are already back. <laughs> There's just something really funny to me about them just refusing to not sleep on me. There's like, fuck you, your lap warm. I don't care what you want. I don't care how much you kick us off, you're comfy. <laughs> it will not feel pain. Oh shit! Can you come with me still? Oh shit, the wind picks up and goes down, it's just like a Celeste. Got this. Got this. Okay, I'm gonna wait for it to blow again. No! Now that the timing on that feels real hard. <laughs> oh no! Oh come on! Oh, good enough. It's sure fucking whimdy up in here. Super fucking whimdy. I'm sure the bard was like, I will keep myself warm with the power of song. But I got it. Oh. Oh, no! What? How is that not a surface that I could stand on? Probably is. I'm doing my best, Flying Seal. Don't judge me. Oh, right. More like the Wind Faker. I don't know if I need the seal for this or not. What? Three <laughs> gears. Okay, okay. It might be a baby baluga. Baby baluga. Oh, Whoa. We're gonna get it. He got this. If you say so, game. If you fucking say so. Look, eat all the rock seal. Just eat them. I love you. Okay. I have no idea where I need to go with you now. Oh! Oh! Ah. That's where we came from, right? Gotta go upper right now?
Oh my god, I'll repeat these are back in my lap and wrestling. <laughs> You're incorrigible. Wait, I gotta take a picture of this real quick. This is illegal. Which, which direction do I need to go in from here if anyone knows? While, while I'm taking a picture of all these fucking babies. Oh my fucking god. Oh my fucking god. Wait. My lens isn't kind of stuck. There we go. Oh my fucking god. Illegal. Okay. Now, what fucking direction do I gotta go in? Do I gotta go up? Looks like maybe there's something up there. Maybe I gotta go from the other side. Yum, yum, yum. So we're not gonna change? What? What the fuck was that? Am I back where I was before? What just happened? Did I hit the, the end of the universe? <laughs> I hit the invisible electric fence on the universe. I love you. I wish I knew where we were going, Seal. Game, I'm begging you to not ruin my enjoyment of Fat Seal. By making everything so fucking difficult all the time. I'm, I'm working on it. I'm working on it, friend. I'm working on it. Wait, so... Oh, I guess I have to get back across. Uh. Here. Okay, I think maybe we have to go up or left here. Back there. Back, back here. Look, I followed those banners. Okay, banners. Banner. Oh, Bruce Banners. Please tell me that was sufficient. Uh, oh. Hey, so. There we go. Hold up. I understand, Seal. I want to get through this too. We're getting through it together, Seal. I love you. Here. I have delicious rock. Here. I love you. <laughs> we got this. Okay. Blah. Is it not going to stop? Oh! 
Don't look at me like that. Don't look at me like that, kittens. Yeah, yeah, that aspect isn't bad. It's more just like making it feel like the individual segments aren't dragging on and stuff. Huh. Oh no, oh no, your parts are starting to separate, Seal. <laughs> the segments of your sprite are starting to separate. Oh no! Hey. Oh wait, you look like, are you an overseer? But you're like out in the real world now? Oh, look at the seal. No. Oh, come on. Must be dog friends. Now I'm trapped in a light ball. Why do you give me things just to take them away, game? Pretty good entrance, right? What do you think? Too much? Stunned silence, got it. Looks like you're in a real pickle here. Lost on a mountain, giant monster. Really calls for a hero, don't you think? Wow, you really no fun this time. I guess that's fine. Let's make this fast, shall we? I say it's finally time to unleash my secret weapon. The potion of power. Fitting, don't you think? This is the one you got for me. And now it's gonna save your life. Oh no, wait! Spare me the theatrics. You aren't seriously still trying to stop me from killing monsters, are you? No, that's not it. Bearish. Are her eyelids coming off her face? <laughs> Sweet. Nah, that's fine. This is all fine. Da ba da ba da ba da ba. All right, kick her while she's down, Bard. Stomp, stomp, stomp. Eat shit, bitch. <laughs> um, are you? Gah. Uh, Where am I? Where's my sword? Did I lose it? Ah, oh, right, the monster. I drank that potion and... I'll look for a way out of here. Is this the time when we're gonna have to learn to get along because we're stuck in a cave together? Oh shit, sorry. It's a total cave-in. We're trapped and my sword is gone. You, you ruined everything as usual. And now, and now, there's no way out. Oh, I think the game's totally gonna want us to be sympathetic to the hero eventually. Probably this is this is the time for us to, to learn to love each other, whatever. Eat shit. What do you think about this? <laughs> what do 
What do you mean by this? Uh, what, what we gotta do here? What are we doing here? I know, maybe we can cause a secondary cave-in that'll get us out of the first cave-in. We might really die here. I might really die here. The hero. Who can't do anything. Not without my sword. Oh! What about the rainbow girl? Yeah, she's like literally trying to end the world and didn't even care about whether that's what she was doing or not. <laughs> Who? The rainbow girl. You know, the messenger of Aya. You mean Ayala? She has a name? <laughs> she's not coming to help. Back in Chandesh, I told her to leave and never come back. Oh, what? Rainbow girl? But I thought you said Aubrey was so cool once you get to know her. <laughs> Why did you do that? She bothered me. No, it wouldn't, Anchir. No, it wouldn't. To end the world? To end the world? <laughs> She's manipulative. She's supposed to be my guide, but she just told me what to do without letting me think for myself. Like she knows better. Last I checked, I'm the hero, not her. A real hero shouldn't be bossed around all the time. If you just follow what everyone says, then you never decide anything for yourself. It's demeaning. You probably wouldn't understand. Ayala didn't either. She'd just tell me what to do, where to go. But I'm not her puppet. It's my job to save the world, so I got rid of her. What? She bothers me too. She told me I could save the world by meeting all the overseers and singing the Earth Song. Are we going to become friends due to our mutual hatred of Rainbow Girl? <laughs> and singing the Earth Song. And that I was special and she believed in me. But it doesn't feel like it at all. The overseers are dying so fast. And no matter what I do, everything's getting worse. When I asked about you, she said... Don't worry about that little bard. The Earth Song is totally made up, and it'll never ever work. You're the real hero. Fuck you, Rainbow Girl. She... she said that? I thought she said the same to you. I had no idea why you kept trying. Guess it makes sense now. She just lied to you. No. She told us different things. Maybe she lied to you, or maybe to both of us. She would never lie to me. I'm the hero. She just told you what you wanted to hear. The fuck? Okay, but you can't pretend that you're like some kind of victim of circumstances here. You're still a poo poo butts. You're still the poo poo butt. So she told you you're not the hero? Yeah. She tested me with your sword, I think, but I couldn't use it. Oh. You must No, I think she's telling the truth. Don't don't fucking still make me think about Bravely Default. I was definitely thinking about Bravely Default. And you know what? In Bravely Default, you, the villains are the ones that are pushing you to, to keep destroying different realities. <laughs> to be able to use it, I think it kinda makes me jealous. Really? I'm really scared about the world ending. I wish I could do anything to stop it. I want to make a difference, but I'm so small. Small. <laughs> and unimportant. You can change things. You can make things happen. But you're using your power to kill overseers. I don't want to give up on the world. No. A after Bailey Default 1, I was to betray. It was criminal. Oh, oh, no! I kicked him on my lap again and here's Marigold again, God damn it! It feels wrong to end everything. I wish it was my choice. Well, that's a relief. Oh. With all of Ayala's lies, I thought for a second that, well, it's ridiculous, but... She made me think I might not actually be the hero. Before this all started, I felt like you do. Small- oh, I felt like you do. Small, weak, normal. Being the hero isn't easy. You have to- Were you even listening to me? 
Don't you have anything to say about that? Making the world end? You're fine with that? Well, I don't know. It's the way it works. How do you know that's how it works? You said yourself that Ayala totally lies. What if one of them- what if that was one of them? I know it because I'm the hero. <laughs> but what if it's made up? You said you were worried you weren't the hero. You didn't let me finish. But what if you aren't? I am. I can use a sword and you can't. That's how it is. Why does using the sword make you a hero? Because that's how it works. <laughs> Nihilist Arby's. <laughs> Look, whatever. I don't care if you think I'm the hero or not. It's totally inconsequential, okay? It doesn't change anything about our situation. I don't- I don't forgive her. I don't- I don't feel like this helps justify her actions at all, right? Because she was like, I didn't care if the world's ending, and he's like, what if you were lied to about the- the fact that what you were doing was ending the world? No, I definitely am ending the world, and I believe that, and that's good- good- good bad. Bag. <laughs> We're really trapped, huh? Yeah. All right. You really want to know the truth? I'm scared. Oh shit, she's like Emerald. <laughs> About ending the world a little bit. Ah, she was doing it despite knowing it was wrong. But that's what the hero is supposed to do. I can't let my little fears control me, even if sometimes it means pretending. I couldn't say that to Ayala because then she'd think I wasn't the hero. What if she changed her mind, took back my sword? I just can't go back to just being nobody. But now that she's gone, what? Aren't she, she she literally said, "Oh, really? I don't care," <laughs> and then didn't bring it up again, and then and then just got mad at us for getting in her way. And you can really decide for yourself. You don't have to do it, do you? What if it's the wrong way to save the world? Have you thought about it? Do you still really want to? Yes. I considered all the angles, and that's the way it has to be. Yeah, when else did we see her being super, like, uncertain and worried? Oh, this is a projecting thing. I don't know anymore what was real, and just what just- and what was just stuff she said. But if there's a chance, even just a tiny one, that the world didn't have to end, and everything would be okay, isn't it worth it to try? Audrey? <gasps> what was that sound? Ah! Bugs! Bugs? Bugs, Audrey! Bugs are here! <laughs> Did they move these rocks? Yes, Audrey. Bugs move rocks. <laughs> they are very good, and they can help us escape. Remember that time she tried to kill and zap the, the little bug friend and the little frog friend? She, she's, she was just so torn up about it. <laughs> so you're saying, I have to rely on bugs to get out of here? Well, I'm friends with the bugs, but we don't have to help you, too. What? We could leave you here to die, bitch. <laughs> You'd leave me here to die? Oh. You have to make a promise, Audrey. You have to promise to be nice. Okay, sure. You have to say it. Say you promise to be nice. 
Really? Yes. Say it. Louder. I promise to be nice. And you have to promise not to end the world. I can't. Yes, you can. That's a very normal, easy thing to promise. <laughs> Look, I can do it right now. I promise not to end the world. <laughs> it's not that simple. The creator of our entire universe chose me to do that. I can't just promise that away. That's not how that works. You, we've just been talking about how much that, that the rainbow hairs lied to you. Fine, but then maybe I shouldn't help you. <laughs> what? Come on. I'm serious. If I help you escape, and you kill the last overseers, it'll be my fault. I couldn't save the world right now. I could leave you here. Oh, I could save the world. <laughs> Don't do that. That won't... Bug. <laughs> Let's get the fuck out of here with the bug friends. I promise not to end the world. There. Okay. Yeah. Nice is different than good. Look, Audrey, I think they're telling us to follow them. Well, don't mind if I do. Did she, did she become one with my with my bod? She's in my inventory now. My people inventory. Oh, there she is. <laughs> I can't believe we're getting out of this. When I realized my sword was gone, I thought I was done for. I feel naked without it. Nice. It's different than good. Check out what I can do, because I'm not a dick. I, I was thinking about it immediately when he was telling her to be nice. I was like, that doesn't make her good. Because nice is different than good. Oh, Audrey! Audrey, where are you? Audrey, are you not coming? Did you decide you don't want to come after all, Audrey? Okay. Look, she has to make her own decisions, you know? Well, you know, because it, it, it has all her power and stuff, and that makes her feel like a super cool hero person. Makes sense. Oh, wait. I, I'm sure, like, if we go to the next screen, she'll be there again or something. Oh, we actually need Audrey? Damn it. <laughs> Too bad. All right. Yo. Sorry, I got some unsingable bugs. <laughs> so I guess you can <laughs> I did to some extent. Why do I trust her? Because she felt bad. Because she said she's scared. Now I trust her explicitly. Implicitly. It's just like Emerald. Jerk butt. Audrey. Don't step on the bugs. What? They're just bugs. They fucking just saved your ass, Audrey. <laughs> they might be tiny and fragile, but they're special. Bugs are cool, Audrey. And they're our friends. And you promise to be nice. Okay, well... Can you ask them to move? Nice is different than good.
Oh wait, maybe here I gotta bring this closer. She's just a small bean whose instinct is murder. Get out of here. See, I don't have to jump so far. The bugs carry me. Look. I'm not arguing anymore about if Audrey's a poo-poo butt. I think she's still a poo but I like I like that she still runs in a way like she should have the sword in her hand, but she doesn't. Do you have a little smooch face? Oh 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 it's the dog with the tongue. Is this an overseer castle? Yes. And I'm the heart fairy. Why is there a castle inside this cave? I don't know. Why is there a cave inside this castle? Oh, it's because the spirit world collapsed, so everything there got pushed into here. Bark. Seems possible. Oh god, it's that, it's that horrible Twitter account. <laughs> I'm furry worried about the world ending. <laughs> Ugh. Wait, so does that mean the overseer is here? No, he left. All this weird stuff started happening at once. The King of Hearts got sick and started acting funny and making monsters. And now we're in a cave and he ran away. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. You're not supposed to do anything. The King of Hearts can't be fixed. The only thing anyone can do is end his misery. I'm sure of that because the Rainbow Girl to- oh, Wait, shit. <laughs> wait a second, Audrey. You promised no killing overseers. That's right, I did. But then, what should we do? Do you think it's better this way? The King of Hearts a beast? Skulking- Wait a second. Is the King of Hearts a big black wolf monster? Yes. Well, he is now. But he was nice before. So that monster we saw earlier- That was the King of Hearts! Stole the tarts! <laughs> Are you really gonna kill him? No. We'll find another way. Right, Audrey? What are you gonna do? Sing to him? What if I fucking do, Audrey? What if I fucking do, Audrey? <laughs> what if I fucking sing to him and then everything's fixed? We just solved a stupid ass war that had been going on forever by singing a song. You probably didn't notice, but we fucking solved all war and racism by singing a song. Maybe. That's ridiculous. That might work. The King of Hearts really likes music. If there's any bit of him left, and you put all your heart into it, you might respond to it. It's worth a shot. <laughs> yes. See, Audrey, we have to try. And you promised. Okay. Okay, fine. We'll do it your way. Sing mit mir. Maybe, maybe it can work after all. That would be nice. How did she get into the spirit realm that one time? He, anyway, who, who did she do it with? Bark. You give me a good feeling. Are you the hero? Oh, nope. That's Audrey. But do you really think I seem like a hero? Yes. I like you. Wow. I like you too. But she'd already told Rainbow Girl to get lost. Pajum, Pajum. She's a fucking cheater, cheater pumpkin eater. Cheater, cheat. <laughs> Even she says fuck stairs. No, cause cause Audrey had to learn the parts of the song. She was going through doing that. So even she has had to solve puzzles with songs. Audrey, you're so full of shit. <laughs> Damn it. Well, I mean, it, it's not, like, unusual to have this general kind of thing, you know, where, like, 
you get stuck with the person you don't get along with like like that you know Katara and Zuko episode that made them like a really strong ship accidentally you know that one but it, it, it's just not really working for me because of the specifics of like what she we've been talking about and what we know about her Do you really think singing is going to do anything? Yes, it has to. I hope you're right for both our sakes. Yeah, it's, it's just that emerald problem again, right? Where, where it, it's like, oh, you were like killing people and stuff and trying to kill everyone, but you were scared and uncertain. So, we're friends now. <laughs> Remember the sun and moon overseers? When overseers are dying, they lose their personality and their shape. And by the end, there's nothing left that's recognizable. So even if the King of Hearts used to love music, there's really no guarantee that part of him is still alive now. Oh, no way. Music never dies, Audrey. You'll see. Yeah, but also the romantic tension, palpable. You could palp it. They hated each other so much, and that's why you know it's romantic. Yo, Audrey. You, you on lean? <laughs> hey, hang on a second. Where's your witchy friend? Oh, Miriam? Oh, 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 she was asking that. You heard her, remember? Oh. <laughs> oh, oh, I guess the, the word bubble was, was like a line kind of weirdly. <laughs> Is a hero thing I don't know about? <laughs> Can you please get your shit together? Yeah, yeah, yeah! I, I was thinking about how you were talking about, you know, there was a character and I was like, oh, it must have been this thing. Hey, she solved it. I like that Audrey better, though. Continue to do that, Audrey. <laughs> Hey. I love Dark Souls. Wow, Dark Souls. <laughs> Classic. My sword now. That's my sword. That stupid dog has it. Where is he taking it? Let's go after him. What's the name of that one dog, Sylph, or whatever, in Dark Souls 1 that's like awesome? Unfortunately, I remember I was a bit OP when I fought it, so it was like a short, it was, the battle was too easy. <laughs> Sif. Sif. Audrey. 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 Janky. She's janky. <laughs> hey. Throw it. That stupid dog, what are you doing? Holding my sword over lava? Give it back your boy. <laughs> I just imagine that having the energy of like, uh, what do you have there? A knife! Hey, what are you doing with my sword? Holding it over lava! Of lava? Fuck! Get back here, boy. No! But why? Yes! My bird friend! That was close. Too close. Well, I assume it's also because it was an earlier game and there might have been a few other, like, you know, UA people and whatnot working on chicory. This thing almost destroyed my sword. That would have been a catastrophe. He's evil. No, Audrey. Don't you see? He's scared. 
He doesn't want you to hurt him. Oh, fuck. I said he's scared. That means anything he does is morally okay. <laughs> That's why he tried to take your sword, but he didn't hurt us. Didn't hurt us? He buried us under a rock slide. We're lucky we escaped alive. Your bird friend has the right idea. The beast hurt them too, didn't he? This isn't what you promised. You have to be nice. Let me just sing. We have to try, Audrey. I think there's still something good inside him. He did, he did trap the birds. Maybe he was trying to protect them from, from all the monsters. That's cool. Oh. <laughs> hmm. That doesn't look good. That thing's just a monster now. I won't listen. It won't listen to us. No. There has to be a way. There might be. If you let me hit it with lightning. That'll stun it, and then you'd be able to get close. Will that hurt him? Yes. What? Fine, but only because I want to help him. Stun gun that motherfucker. Please don't do more than you have to. Ha 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 ha! Hey, could you make yourself useful and maybe cover me? I can't charge up because he's attacking me. I don't even know what I'm supposed to be doing, sorry. Oh, I see. What? How, what is theoretically supposed to be happening there? Wow, I can't believe we can solve problems with song. Uh, though sometimes our song can can attack rocks and and blast them. What was I supposed to be doing there? <laughs> Shit. Ha 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 I was singing, but obviously I wasn't singing correctly. Yeah, I saw the bits of him flying off, but I didn't know what was... Did that mean I was succeeding? Okay. Aha. Oh yeah, he's just a stinky dirty dog. Gotta get shower. Yo, charge your shit faster, Audrey. 
It's true, we were better at it. Aha! Give it the zippy zaps. Oh, come on. Give it the zippy zaps. Give it the little zippy Oh, come on, I couldn't even get... Okay. I don't understand. Is there a reason that she's not using it? Okay. <laughs> the game just didn't want to let me yet. You're getting smaller and smaller. No. Rule of threes, motherfucker. Rule of threes! I'll destroy you. Audrey, I changed my mind. We can kill him. Yeah, it, it is interesting that it seems to be such a consistent thing. How am I- I can't- Should I be- Should I be speed singing over there? Can I speed sing? Can we dance? Ah, uh, easy dodgy. Oh wow, that works. Okay. Charge your shit. Yeah. I mean, I, I, I did try to help you that time. Wait, your thing is charged. Ah. What? You can do it in the middle of attacks? Get out of here. What if it just died? We just found another way to accidentally kill them. Hey. You're the king of hearts, right? I bet nobody even tried to talk to you. But you're not really so bad, are you? Urgh. I sure was being unfairly mean to Audrey. It sure was rude of me to still judge her so harshly. Audrey, you... you promised. Yeah, well, I lied. But why? The King of Hearts wasn't bad. He didn't have to die. You just don't get it, and maybe you never will. This is just how it had to happen. And I did what I had to, to make sure it did. I told you, I can't just promise away my responsibility. Being the hero is more than that. Then being the hero is stupid. It's stupid and I hate it. It's stupid and I hate it and you didn't have to do it. You could have chosen different. We could have healed the Overseer and fixed everything and stopped the world from ending, but you ruined it. You ruined everything. Sorry. Be gone, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> um, Betch, um, be gone. Out of my presence, Betch. <laughs> Bobby. No. How you doing? Leave me alone. 
I don't want to talk to you ever again. What? You're a liar. This is just a game to you. You don't really care about us at all. You talking to me? <laughs> you don't care if the world ends. You don't care about anything. I thought I could be a hero. I thought I could change something, but it was all a lie to make me feel good. You should never have listened to you. Oh, I should never have listened to you. Little bee. That hurts. Yeah, too bad, bitch. But it's not true. I really didn't lie to you, I swear. Actually, I came to tell you. I'm totally on your team now. I need a... I need a middle finger. I need the ability to give a middle finger. Oh. Yeah. I mean, you're still definitely not the hero, but that doesn't matter. You're good. And there's still a chance to stop the end of the world. There's still one more overseer. The one we, um... The Dream King? Yeah, I told Audrey as much that maybe she should stop and give you time to collect the Earth Song. But she really didn't like that one bit. Really? I don't trust this girl either. I think she's really scared, Little B. When I said she should wait for you, she acted like I was talking, taking something from her. I think she really wants to be the hero. Basically, no matter what, she's kind of dangerous. I mean, I love you both, but she's gotta be stopped. Then there's no time to waste. Yeah. We need to hurry back to Langtree. Right. But first, you gotta collect the King of Hearts song. <laughs> right. But this lady was also like being a dick. And insisting Audrey was good and stuff, and I don't... <sighs> I want Miriam back. No idea what's happening. I mean, I seem to be progressing or something, so that's cool. Yeah, I don't like either of them. They both suck. Gotta release the string to strum. Oh, I see. What? Sure. I air quotes solved it <laughs> it's really weird if Audrey was just lying about Ayala and stuff
But but what a weird game thing then. Like, oh, she's just scared. And also like a huge liar that wants to kill the world and is like manipulating people and shit. Song in the Storm. Yeah, I really don't buy at least so far that the game wants you to hate Audrey just because of the some like the dialogue and stuff just feels like it doesn't quite work still. I think it's just being a little too forgiving of her for being a super poo poo butt munch. Sweet Miriam. Miriam, sweet Miriam. Miriam, I have been surrounded by nothing but bitches all day long. <laughs> Come here, Robertson, did it. Miriam. Pleb. Are you feeling better? Good enough. Is her grandma okay? She's fine. I gotta say my goodbyes to her. Figured I'd see you here. Just one more overseer, right? Right. I was so scared with it. It was so scary without you, Miriam. Everyone was huge bitches. <laughs> I met the hero again, and I thought we would be friends, actually. But she didn't want that. Yeah, no crap. <laughs> but she also told me some things. She's not evil, Miriam. She's just misunderstood. I think that means the same thing. I don't even care about her. Yes, Miriam. Miriam is objectively correct. I came to see you. I'm sorry I left. I couldn't let you do this part on your own. Oh. Miriam. This isn't a joke. This is really it, Plib. We're gonna have to face the Dream King and probably Miss Hero too. If she kills him, it's all over. The world is actually gonna end. And everything we worked for, and all the places we've seen, and all the people we know, they're gonna go away. Do you understand that? Yeah. I'm scared, Miriam. Which means I can do anything now and it's forgivable. <laughs> but we'll just have to do our best. I'm glad I'm doing it with you. You. Okay. Let's go. Smooch, smooch, smooch. Miriam. You have no idea what I've seen with these bitches. <gasps> oh no! Do you remember this place? I picked you up on my broom here and flew you to Delphi. Oh yeah, that's how our adventure started. Oops. Sorry! <laughs> Bean. There's so many. We got some real ruby problems up in here. Oh. Mask. Hey now, Wonder. I'm not surprised to see you here. Do you like these spook vibes? <laughs> We've been all over the world together now. It's been a huge adventure for me. I bet it has for you too. But someday the adventure's gonna end, doesn't it? Everything's gonna end someday. I'm glad to share our connection, Wonder. We only crossed paths briefly here and there, but I think it made a difference. It's amazing, isn't it? Even the tiny little things we do, they can send out ripples that change all the people around us, and then all the people around them, and then the whole world. We just gotta make our ripples good. Oh shit! And the whole world. It's. It's. It's... <laughs> I 
Bounce people. Little bird. Goodness, it's been some time. You must... Wait, that's a little bird. You must have had the most wonderful adventure. I want to hear all about it. I met a bunch of bitches, and they lied to me, and are trying to kill the world, and I'm still supposed to be sympathetic to them. <laughs> oh, the end is coming soon, isn't it? I'm having the most dreadful thought that there isn't even enough time for you to tell me all your stories. I miss talking with you, little bird. We used to talk forever and ever, didn't we? But there's no more forever left. Kiddo, ain't you a sap sore eyes? Things sure went to heck out here. Maybe you noticed. <laughs> Did everything I could for my folks here, but there's only so much you can do. Reckon this is the end of the world <laughs> mentioned. Did you come to wash too? <laughs> it's so dark out, and everyone's so dour. It's bad enough the world is ending. Why does everyone have to be so depressing on top of that? <laughs> Sorry! Do not apologize, Ruby. Where I gotta go. Whoops! Oh! Going to get through this entire game without ever understanding the platforming mechanics at all. <laughs> oh, I see you, game. I see what you're doing. Ungrow. <laughs> Buck. Oh god. Yes, it did, Fien. It did. It sucked. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Now the shoe's on the other foot. On the other bird foot. Look, what's your backstory? What's your character backstory? Wait, how do I do that while... Sense. Oh. All right, ungrip. Oh, I probably got to grow it still. I think this is probably my favorite, like, use of the singing puzzle mechanic stuff. I like that Miriam is right here, but not giving me a ride. <laughs> is she? She looks fine. She fine. Yeah, yeah. Guys, see that cat? <gasps> oh boy, you again at a time like this? What is it with you humans waiting until the worst possible moment to show up? 
Stuff's going about to go down. Big stuff. The Dream King's fading, and once he's gone... Fading? Oof. The whole world's over. You sure you want to be here for it? You should go hold someone you love or something. The King of Hearts didn't make it back after all. Oh, I'm sorry. I really tried. That's okay. Losing your overseer is part of being a fairy, even though it's sad. I knew to expect it. Talking to everyone here made me feel a lot better. <laughs> I know it's gonna be okay. I'm still sorry, but I'm glad you're okay. That that makes this smile on the bard look creepy <laughs> in response to that. You come <laughs> for the end too, hmm? It's a bit like a party here. So fun. I love parties. Oh, nya nya. Meow had a feeling you'd be here again. Because of my determination? Something like that. Mr. Dream King has only gotten worse. He spent a lot of time away avoiding the hero, but he can't do that anymore. He's really sick. Meow is worried he doesn't have much longer. Good thing we made it just in time. I'll sing to him. I've been all over the world now. I have every piece of the Earth song. Except his. So it's totally different from last time. This time he has to listen. Meow isn't so sure about that, but you don't care what Meow thinks, do you? Nope. Sheesh. Damn. <gasps> I love you. Oh, hello. You've come time for the end. We've all gathered here to bear witness. <laughs> for the universe. <gasps> Wait, what's up? Thanks for busting me and Moody out of the spirit world. We had a bunch of cool adventures together here. Hey, look at how they, they're just fine and sentient still and didn't cause any problems in the real world at all. Yes. Oh, it's you. Talking to everyone here is so scary. Everyone's overseers are gone. I miss the moon's queen, but at least I have Sunny. Oh, hello, kittens. Oh, my kittens. Small. Time for fuck stairs. Fuck stairs. As a concept, I don't need them. Why do they exist? Oh, shit, it's Bowser's castles. Was it like seeing Safi again? It was nice. I really missed her. We're just talking in front of <laughs> Maybe it's stupid, but I was so worried she wasn't gonna be there. Everything's a mess in Delphi too. Monsters everywhere. And you know, she's so old. When I saw her, it got very emotional. I'm just not good at that stuff. Why am I even telling you all this? Don't be embarrassed. I'm glad she was okay too. <laughs> Mr. Dream King. Oh, good. How, uh, how you doing? Fantastic. Definitely not deteriorating at an alarming rate. Still got my winning personality and charm, see? Mr. Dream King, we really gotta talk. Oh boy, great. The hero's on her way here right now. And you're on- and you're the very last overseer. If she kills you, that's the end of the world. Oh wow, really? Thanks, didn't know that. Enough with the sass. We need the Earth Song from you before you're dead. Give me the last piece now. Okay, sure. You will? No. You know, it almost makes me sad realizing you will never get it. Because you won't give it. I don't mean the Earth Song. I mean it. You've traveled all over the world, now you must have seen yourself. Everything is falling apart, everyone's losing hope. Those aren't just the signs of the end coming, that's what the end is. It's inevitable. Collecting song pieces doesn't matter. And clinging onto the Earth Song as some kind of easy answer for all our problems. That's what's sad. 
this world was over before you even started. That's it. You want to just give up? On the Earth Song, it's impossible. Everyone and everything are moving apart. Always have been. Ever since the universe started. Expanding, decaying. If the world the whole world could still act together as one, the end wouldn't have come in the first place. Look, I don't want it to be over either. I did everything I could to delay it. I broke the rules, but that made everything worse. The world outside turned ugly while I stalled. People are suffering. Making the world go on longer just isn't natural. You need to let go of it. That was easy. That's the end then, right? Credits roll. Thanks for playing. Yo. I can't believe you did that, Audrey. <laughs> Quit acting so surprised. You both did a great job getting in my way at every step, but in the long run, it was pointless. I win. You losers never stood a chance. Feels good, to be honest. I almost wish it wasn't this easy. Ayala told me about what happened between you. She didn't lie to you, did she? She believed in us. If you had just waited, we could have saved the Dream King. She told you that, huh? Okay, it's true. In the end, even Ayala turned on me. That's why I ditched her. Because she was wrong. And if you never understood that, it doesn't matter. It's over. Whatever. Oh, crap. Is it happening? I don't know. I, I don't know. I don't think all that shit down there was supposed to be a lie. And, and Rainbow Girl still sucks either way. <laughs> now that's more like it. A real final boss. You're insane. That means we still have a chance. We have to stop her from killing the Dream King. I know that. One last chance. You, me, and a giant evil boss monster against one lone hero. Pretty good odds, right? Fuck yeah. Dream King, let's kick her ass. Oh. Arg, this is stupid. We can't protect the Dream King forever. Eventually, she's just gonna win. What do we do? Steal her sword. She can't do anything without it. Steal her sword? That's ridiculous. But okay. <laughs> you focus on distracting her. I'll go for the sword. There we go. Beat her ass. Oh shit, I see. Well, that was one sword, so I assume that we, we have to touch it four times. Let's do this. Oops. I do another attack Dream King. Come on. 
I love having to aim it at her off screen. Alright, two. Two down. Oh god, it better not be actually possible for the Dream King to die during this. Like, making us redo it or something. Please, no. Oh no! I can still get her. Fuck you. Fuck you, fuck you. Fuck you. I'm glad I never got around to drawing you, hero. Still gonna draw Miriam at some point. Sure, whatever, whatever. Is there any way to get her with the stars now, or do I just have to wait till he does the vine thing instead? What? That hurt her? Oh, it still adds to her distraction points. <laughs> yeah! Don't move. You. Audrey, you losers, ruining everything, and I actually mean ruining everything. This is my quest. This is my story. Everything that exists is at stake. How dare you try to take that for yourself? How dare you try to make it about you? It isn't. Audrey, you're special. What? I said you're special, even if you weren't the hero, I mean. Audrey, you're super strong and super smart and really great at everything you do. I get why you were picked to be the hero. You deserve it. You... Really? But, that doesn't mean you have to do it. Being the hero is just a title. You can do whatever you want. And you'd still be special. I really mean it. Let's stop fighting. If you just give up on doing your way, maybe you wouldn't be the hero. But I could learn the Earth song from the Dream King. And stop the world from ending. We could actually save the world. Everyone would be okay, and you'd be a real hero. Okay? That's not enough. Game. Game. Can you make up your fucking mind game? <laughs> Silence. What lesson did we learn? I'm really not sure. She whiffed her scarf, but did she nene? Was there like a girl in high school that bullied you? <laughs> I 
What, what feelings are you trying to work out in this video game? Doing the Earth song, we're doing it. No, we ended racism, it's over now. Yeah, that's weird, that's like, so it's like we did a mini Earth song last time, which is weird. don't know what the mood I'm supposed to be feeling here is. I guess this is kind of like a but the world refused to die vibe? Oh, there's where we find out that maybe he's her papa. without I hit the up joystick as lightly as I could. Damn it. as lightly as I possibly could. Oh, can I like... Oh my god. I did have to immediately press down after I pressed up.
Fuck these weeches. Fuck these weeches. I don't know if this is supposed to be for a younger a younger audience though. There's like such a weird cynicism in parts and stuff. It's very strange. Okay, I never figured out what I was doing here. That worked? Okay. Once again, I solved that puzzle without knowing what the fuck that puzzle was. And that's a great skill. <laughs> Boogs, my precious Boog friends. Only the bugs may live. I'm back. Madri. She's right. Let's destroy this world and make a, a, a new one that like is a little more properly formed. You know? Why do I have to do this again? So emotionally compelled. <laughs> I'm, so I'm sorry, have I ruined your, your love of this game? <laughs> Excellent. I feel like people say much more generally good things about Chicory. I wouldn't be surprised if it's more polished and stuff. Ash's song was really good! But yeah, I think, you know, like, that that's all, that's frustrating in its own way, because there, there's little good parts in there. It's not just, like, you know, like, a bad game. What? Are you kidding me? 
I don't want to. <laughs> No! Fuck all y'all. Fuck all y'all. I will save the babies, but only the babies. Oh wow, look at all these girls who didn't really care that their sister was dead and kind of shit on her ghost. I was really emotionally compelled by those characters. Oh fuck you. Oh yeah, she theoretically does. Or we could kill her. Sure, why not? <laughs> oh, hello, little friends. Hello. You may live because you are all baby. You are all bit bit. <laughs> I guess we're supposed to like Rainbow Girl again now, but I don't. She kept assuring us Audrey was great and we just needed to get to know her. We got to know her. It's so funny because this should be such an easy thing to get me. It's like a, you know, dramatic everybody singing and friendship thing. Normally that works on me very well. Oh my gosh. I am so, 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 so proud of you two. We did it, right? Did we do it? I thought it was over. We never got the last piece of the Earth song. I thought so too. But in the end, it didn't matter. 
when you reach out with your voice, the whole world answered back, and Aya heard you. Fuck Aya! Fuck Aya! She saw you all working together just for a moment. And it was just enough to harmonize with her new song. What you sang wasn't the Earth song, it was something special that only you could have done. And even after an infinite infinities, you were actually the most specialist of all. And it's okay that you weren't special because actually you were the most special in every universe that's ever existed after all. <laughs> Of the universe is beginning and ending and beginning again. I've never seen anything like it. That's why I'm so proud of you two. Nobody ever tried like you did. It wasn't even supposed to be possible. You said that you've seen so many people try and fail. But you made it possible. You changed the rules forever. You gave hope to everything that exists. And that's just so special. She actually said special. <laughs> Are you serious? What about what happened to Audrey? Oh wait. Okay, the fairies are growing into new overseers. That's that, that's all right. Oh. Well, we're here. You said you wanted to check in on your friends, right? Ready to keep going? <laughs> Miriam, you stupid bitch. I said I wanted to check in on my friends. <laughs> Wait, Audrey is just gone now? What did they say happened with her? Because I'm not talking to all these guys. This is like some weird dark mirror of the Undertale ending. It's so weird. It's wrong. Well, you're, you're powerful. I like you. you. I can't talk to <laughs> I can't talk to you. I actually want to talk to that one. I can't. Oh, mama. No, ho, ho. It's my muffin. Are you finally moving back in with mama? No. What a shame. Yeah, hi, you came back. Me and Doggy are doing so great. We never would have come together without you. Thank you so much. I mean it. She taught me a lot about myself. Nobody in this town ever believed in me before you. But now it feels like everyone does. Good doggy. No, wait, no, wait. Okay, you said people talk about Audrey. Oh, Toll. What do they say about her? Hello, Captain. Matey. It's been so long. 
Have you been adventuring? We've been on some of our own. The mermaids joined our crew now. We sound even better than ever, matey. You gotta sing with us again soon. Woohoo. Me and my girls are taking over the ship. No more hiding out on a secret island for us. We're adventurers now. It's pretty great. We're zooming. I don't want to talk to you, all of you. I want to talk to the small. Where's the small? Maybe she she's in the other place. What the fuck? She was just gonna die. I mean, it makes sense, but it's also like, what the fuck is the tone of this goddamn game supposed to be like if Audrey's just a horrible lying person and then dies and then we all sing a togetherness song because we killed the one person who wasn't redeemable even though the game kept trying to tell us about the different way she could be redeemable. She's just misunderstood. Granted, she does have to stop existing so that we can save the world, but that's just because nobody understands her properly. Oh wait, I, I can't believe Delphi's still here. When we left, it really seemed like it was over for this place. I'm glad. I can't buy that the bard's supposed to be wrong, though. The bard is the, declared the most special baby and saves the entire world. I like you, big scarf bird. She didn't get redeemed, but the bard insisted she's not a bad person, and then the bard wins the game by having everyone love friendship. Oh, it's so good to see you. <laughs> it's a running theme, and it runs all the way to the ending where the bard saves the entire world. Like, two seconds after he says that about Audrey. Miriam told me so much about you. She did. Oh my, yes. She cares about you so much, and you made her feel kind of worn she never had before. She might never tell you that, but it means so much to hear that from her. It, it, it makes it seem like Audrey was like literally the only bad person in the world. That's the idea. Everyone else could sing the get together song and get along and save the world. Only Audrey had to stop existing. But also she's misunderstood. She's such a lonely girl, you know? Thank you for being there for her. Oh, the human. The okay human. We met some more okay humans. This witch kept us safe when the world fell apart. We're starting to think humans might just be okay. Only just starting, though. They might still be terrible. I think they're okay. Error. But those moments were literally five seconds apart. What? You're leaving just like that to Miriam after bringing your friend all this way? That simply won't do. Ask if they'd like to stay for dinner. Yeah. You want to stay and have dinner with us? Oh, you want to stay and have dinner with us? That sounds nice. It was really wa wrong of her to want to be the most special. Granted, we wanted to be the most special, and at the end we were told we were the most special ever, but like...
So... It's goodbye, huh? Just for now, but we're gonna hang out all the time, right? I hope so. Oh, they hug, that's good. I'm tired. Me too. We came a really long way together, didn't we? Yeah. Thanks for saving the world with me. Yeah. And the same people that gave Audrey the sword and told her to destroy the entire world are the ones who were supposed to be like, yay, they accepted us as the most special and actually decided that to, to not destroy the world. Isn't that cool? Thanks for being my friend. Damn, friend zone right at the end. Okay, bye. Thank you for playing. Alright. Thank you for the sub. <laughs> His sleeping sounds are still cute. I sleep. I sleep. Thank you for playing. <laughs> Thank you for playing. You can now access scene select. Look, Snail, it's gonna be okay. It's gonna be okay. sick. I'm almost starting to enjoy my rage. I'm a salty gal. I'm a salty gal. I'm a salty, salty gal. Mm -mm -mm. Uh, mm Um, I have to see if I have time to make my costume in time for tomorrow, which I which I hope to start tonight. But t t we will we'll probably start streaming H Hades tomorrow, or it might be mm, I might have to take tomorrow off so that Cube can you know like work on more SD and stuff. We should probably plan to not tomorrow. We should probably plan to take a day off between games in any case. So, so so we can we can no stream tomorrow and then Hades start on on Thursday. On Thursday. I I've already seen a lot of the character designs just because you know like there's so much fan art and stuff around. I I, I already love Artemis, and I I'm I, and the Medusa. We're gonna find lots of cool friends. Quit the game, yeah. Oh, we can do a we can do a special kind of cursed t uh, arm because it's it's gonna have lines, so that's good. Check this out. Oh, that's actually not so bad. Sayonara.
look, killing like it's a catcher thing. It's a catcher thing. It's a catcher thing but not but no but it is no but she was bad so she was bad to the end but the, but the, but the, 